let's talk about some of the techniques you're using in writing. Tell us about starts. How do you start? Well, basically, I start by jumping in. I usually start by action and I sort of want to have energy and I want people to be excited. Often a joke, but not a cliche joke. So I'm going to just read this tiny beginning. So this is how Jack starts in I Am Jack. Mum's talking to Nana. She'd, she said she'd only be a minute. That is such a lie. A minute means an hour in mum time. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. You, you get such a picture of the kid. Exactly. You know Jack's character because of his attitude. You know he's going to be in a scene with his mum and Nana. And you also know the truth that adults talk endlessly and they do tell lies. They say, I'll be a minute. Not going to happen. You've got Gracie and Josh there. All oh, right, I love the start of that. So you want to read that to us? I will. And it shows you when you start a book or any piece of writing, you don't have to write really, really long introductions with heaps of words. You've got to trust the reader. So here it is, Gracie and Josh. My name is Gracie. Today, I'm a squiggly black spider. There she is running across the page and you immediately know that you're in love with Gracie and that she's adventurous and that she's dressing up. It's a whole lot of information in literally two tiny short lines. Yeah, that's what? That's six, nine words. Nine words. We've got the character immediately. Mm. Another way I always think, I like I remember with uh, Shadow Seeker when I wrote that, I must have, hmm, 10, 12 times go on over the start and I started with um, something like, you try delivering a rap to the biggest newsreader in town. And that is such a fabulous um, opening. I mean, you'd want to know, why did you deliver the rap? That's Where's the story going? You already know the characters are very adventurous and right out there. And it makes us interested to go on. Yeah, make the reader curious mm. and start with lots of action. That's what mm. we're always saying. Mm.